Hi, today I'm gonna connect a small test tank to my diesel generator. The generator is a GB6500 DC3. And uh, the extra tank is for testing different biofuels like rapeseed oil and stuff like that. I have made a small rack to hang the um, fuel tank from so that uh, it won't shake so bad yes, if I attach it to the generator. I start with uh, removing the <coughs> fuel hose from the tank down to the diesel pump and uh, it's held only by a clip so it's easy to remove. I uh, remove the hose and uh, shut off the fuel. The reason for adding a test tank is so that I can fill like a 0.3 of a liter fuel and easily change fuel and see how much I consume. After removing the fuel hose I add a new fuel hose to the new tank. To this fuel hose I also add a new fuel valve. After connecting the new uh, fuel hose, I connect uh, the bleed hose from the fuel injector. The bleed hose from the fuel injector I just uh, pull down to the new test tank through the lid of the test tank. This is so uh, all fuel that leaks over there goes back to the tank and being used so I know exactly how much I consume. When uh, running the test I will add about uh, 0.3 liters of uh, diesel fuel, run it and uh, measure how many um, kilowatts I get from it. After that I will empty this uh, small tank and uh, fill it with, uh, in this case rapeseed oil would be the first test. Then I will test several of fuels. So now the hose from the fuel connectors was uh, connected and into the tank. Now the test tank is uh, complete. So I will fill it with um, like 0.1 uh, liter of uh, diesel fuel to test. There will be some problems of course with air in the fuel system. Diesel engines really don't like air in the fuel. Now it's time to test the tank system. I run the fuel pump a little before I hit the run lever to see if it starts. And it starts. Don't miss the next video when I am trying to run on rapeseed oil. And uh, please subscribe to my channel so you can see the next video. And hit the like button if you like this stuff. Thank you and goodbye.